Welcome to the Griffin Real Estate Market Update. I'm Danny Griffin. If you are thinking about buying or selling residential property in Boston right now or in the near future, it's very important to stay up with the local market trends. Now, according to MLS PIN, the marketplace for Boston residential properties, here's what happened in the year of 2023 versus the previous year of 2022. The number of sold listings decreased by 21% to 1,408 properties with a top sale of 23 million located at 776 Boylston Street. The average sales price increased 19% to 1.84 million and the average price per square foot increased by 9% to $1,245 per square foot. The inventory of properties available for sale is measured in months supply decreased by 5% to 2.51 months worth of properties for sale, and the average 30-year fixed mortgage rate increased 2%, with an average rate of 6.9%, according to bankrate.com. Now, what's obviously significant is just the massive continued torrid pace in the highest end of luxury sales. It continues its pace and it continues to skew the average price and the average price per square foot upwards. However, what is notable is that during the COVID pandemic, there was a much more limited inventory than there is now. As we go into the first quarter and interest rates begin to cool off, we will see if people become more mobile and put their property in the market looking to trade up, trade down, or make a move in a more normalized market, but we'll keep you up to date on that. Of course, if you're thinking about buying or selling residential property now or in the very near future, it is important to connect with a local real estate market uh, professional who can keep you updated on the statistics so that you can get the best deal possible if you're buying and of course top dollar if you're selling. We'll be back in the next Griffin Real Estate Market Update to help you navigate the topsy-turvy market that residential has been over the last several years. Thanks for tuning in.